Yes, welcome back to Entrepreneurship Tuesday on Y in the morning on Y254 channel, your favorite channel. So Y254 underscore channel on Instagram and Y254 on Facebook, Y254, uh, Y254 channel uh, on Twitter and Y254 channel on YouTube is the way to reach us. Don't forget the hashtags on this particular day for entrepreneurship is Entrepreneurship Tuesday or Hustle Tuesday or Y in the morning, the hashtag if you'd like to interact with us or talk to us. So I go by the name of Barry Moses or it's Barry Moore on every social media platform and thank you again for tuning in to Y in the Morning on Y254. So it's about that time that I introduce my uh, my guest of the day and is an entrepreneur out there, but is not only about the money, but it's also about the culture and heritage and anti-radicalization through fashion. He goes by the name James Kangather or Jim Jim. AKA yeah, yeah, Karim Jim Jim. Mm -hmm. Sana. All right, Jim Jim, uh, your camera <laughs> is number four. A uh, yes. brief bio of yourself as we carry Okay, on. so mm -hmm. my name is James Mukunjura mm -hmm. Kangede, uh -huh. and my nickname is Jim Jim, as uh -huh. you said. Uh -huh. So I'm a student at the uh -huh. University of Nairobi studying uh -huh. economics, uh -huh. and I act. Uh -huh. I, I gym, uh -huh. <laughs> I help people in You're fitness, fitness as well. Enthusiast. Yeah, uh -huh. so I help people in fitness. Uh -huh. And I'm the, I'm the CEO of Culture Kimayhem brand. Uh -huh. So what is Culture Kimayhem? Uh -huh. That's Culture Kimayhem yeah. uh, is a big question, by the yeah, way. Culture yeah. Kimayhem, because mayhem is a very aggressive word, if you ask me. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but you're preaching culture and anti-radicalization. True. Before we get to the brand itself, mm -hmm. uh, you're a student of economics. Yeah. Economics. Mm -hmm. uh, you're a fitness enthusiast. Yeah. Are you making money off fitness as well? Yeah, I do. So far, you do. Yeah. All right. Uh, there's uh, the acting bits as well. Mm -hmm. You're making money off acting as well. Yeah, I'm doing. So um, it's only right that I say you're a serial entrepreneur. <laughs> you're in this thing for real. <laughs> okay, I, I can say that. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. As mm -hmm. a as a young person, mm -hmm. I also like to motivate. Mm -hmm. Fellow youths, I'm mm -hmm. a youth leader in mm -hmm. our church. Mm -hmm. I deal with. So you go to church as well. True. You're not a raster. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not a raster far, right? mm -hmm. but I'm a, I'm a dreaded guy. You're a dreaded guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So. Uh, this is the reason we're here today. Yes. Uh, the fitness thing and uh, the the guidance, the the guidance thing. We'll talk about it some other time. Okay. Culture, ki mayhem, the mm -hmm. brand. Culture, I know. Ki, uh, I know. Mm -hmm. Mayhem, I don't get why mayhem is in the same statement. As as well as culture and yes. key. So mm -hmm. this is what is happening here. I'm not selling only the T-shirt. I'm mm -hmm. selling the message. Mm -hmm. I want to tell people that. As, as the 21st century guys uh -huh. and uh -huh. as the centennials, uh -huh. we need to embrace our culture. Uh -huh. You know, like, people, people see dreaded guys and they say that, uh -huh. so that's why I want to stop the radicalization among the dreaded people. As uh -huh. you can see, this guy has dreads. Uh -huh. and The we, logo. Yeah, the logo. Uh -huh. Like, we can, we can make it. Uh -huh. Dead guys can go to offices. Uh -huh. We can be lawyers. We've seen lawyers. Yeah. Already. We can be lawyers. Now we, are, we have an economist in the making right True. here. We have seen, uh, people assume that dreaded people are artists mostly. Mm -hmm. But your message in this is for the dreaded people. Okay, it's for like every person. Mm -hmm. But I want to put the dreaded in person the, the in the, dreaded yeah, yeah, in the main picture. All right. So mm -hmm. what really drove you to... To this point, before we d talk about what drove you to this point, mm -hmm. mayhem. We have not talked about this mayhem. Part. So mm -hmm. mayhem, mm -hmm. mayhem, it's an English word mm -hmm. means like chaos or something. Mm -hmm. So we want to bring this culture in a chaotic way. All right. To the people. So there's a deeper meaning. There's to a it. deeper meaning uh -huh. to this, and we want to embrace our culture, uh -huh. like the African culture. Mm -hmm. Let, uh, let us not adopt and the... are the as African culture. Yeah. Uh -huh. Leave your hair for some time and you put it shredded. Uh -huh. You'll come up with dreads. Uh -huh. It's so an African root. It's something route. we've had in Africa. Yeah. The Mau Mau guys had dreadlocks. We have the... the guys who fought for independence. Yeah, freedom fighters. Game. Yes. They had dreadlocks. Dead and Kimati. Uh -huh. We have the other also guys who had dreads. Uh -huh. And in Africa, mm -hmm. I guess we can embrace this culture. Mm -hmm. Let us not just adopt the Western culture. Mm -hmm. You know why? Uh -huh. Because this is what is happening. The Western guys came to Africa, mm -hmm. and now it's like 
we we adopted their culture mm -hmm. and like they want to they want to they want to they come want to, to keep africa colonizing us. yeah they want uh -huh. to keep colonizing us and even some of them uh -huh. they are like they want to be part of africa uh -huh. it's like we are shining we are off seeing, our culture yes we are seeing the movement happening right now especially yeah. in the 21st century True. Uh, africa is the is the capital of business right now everybody is coming together it's the stick. hub it's the hub right it's now it's a hub as and jack ma said uh -huh. in africa we have like Okay, the other continents are polluting so much. Uh -huh. But in Africa, we have trees, we have forests. Uh -huh. What are we doing? We're not polluting as much as they are. Uh -huh. So they want to come to adopt the culture in Africa. And uh -huh. they want to come to stay in Africa. Uh -huh. The air is cleaner in Africa. The air is cleaner and in like Africa. Unlike what MJ, <laughs> MJ said to them. Like, All right, so the dreaded person. I see the dreaded character mm -hmm. and culture is being brought in a very aggressive way. We need to take affirmative action. Yeah. when it comes to our culture yeah. and take the driver's seat as the Kenyan youth right now. Yes. Since the the, the previous generation has somehow failed yeah, true. in this. <laughs> so part of the culture is dreadlocks. Part of the culture is dreadlocks. We should not be judging people with dreadlocks and not. putting them in categories that don't make sense. Yeah, true. All right, I have another t-shirt mm -hmm. at hand with me right here. A very lovely This is a head wrap right here. Yeah, so we have... For a woman. The lady uh -huh. who has a turban. Uh -huh. A turban represents the African culture as well. Mm -hmm. So we have like what is happening in our in the country right now. We we see people bleaching and stuff. Yes, which so is very disturbing. It's yeah? so disturbing. People are mm -hmm. bleaching. You end up getting cancer. You end up getting skin disease. Uh -huh. You Why end up not? looking really pathetic when you get scary. older. Uh -huh. you scary. Scary. Not pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So what you have to do is uh -huh. embrace our culture. Uh -huh. If you want to shave, shave your hair. Uh -huh. Put a turban on it. Uh -huh. You don't have to put a lot of makeup on your face. Uh -huh. Be natural. Uh -huh. And embrace our African culture. <laughs> okay, it's just her, but you're leaving. I'm going to go back to the culture. to embrace the culture. So, head wrap is another representation of the African culture. Yeah. The head wraps. We used yeah. to wrap our heads uh, for the ladies. Even the men used to wrap their heads. Yeah. So if you can't uh, have the dreadlocks, just wrap it really nicely. Yeah. And yeah. let's not uh, put uh, some chemicals in our hair that are, are not really healthy true. for us. True, true. We have the organic oils. We have the natural oils for our hairs. All right. So uh, I had iso chemicals you find your memories in Apote after a while. But <laughs> <laughs> I don't know the fact about it, but Y254 <laughs> channel on Twitter, Y254 underscore channel on Instagram, and Y254 on Facebook is the way to reach us. Don't forget to leave the hashtag Y in the morning and Entrepreneurship Tuesday or Hustle Tuesday. Or you can hit me up directly at It's Barry Moore on every social media. Check the YouTube as well. Mm -hmm. So uh, the mission is to preach the message. Yeah. As much as That's you're getting, main goal. as much as you're selling the, yeah. the pieces as, much, as well. Okay, you, you know something? Uh -huh. You can go put a design on a t-shirt uh -huh. and you can just sell your t-shirt to uh -huh. your friends or something. Uh -huh. But what I'm doing, I want to sell the message to uh -huh. the people uh -huh. that we should embrace our culture uh -huh. as Africans. Uh -huh. Let's embrace our culture and let's spread that culture uh -huh. throughout other people. All right. It's not only about the t-shirt because I know you can put something on a t-shirt and uh -huh. you can just sell it. All right. But I want to sell the message. All right. As you put on the t-shirt and you go around town, people ask, Hey, wh what does this T-shirt mean? You say, I'm embracing culture. I, was, uh, I asked the question as well. Hmm. It, 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 it provokes something, the, <laughs> yeah. the message itself. Right, you're originally from, uh, from Mount Kenya. Yeah? <laughs> okay. so, yeah, yeah, true, right. true. What about your culture stands out for you that you really wish people could bring back? Okay, I, I'd like people to bring back the cultures and the traditional weddings. Uh -huh, traditional weddings, yeah. number one. I like them as well. <laughs> Yeah, uh -huh. traditional weddings. Mashakura. <laughs> Mashakura. Uh -huh. The, what are they called? Kotinia Kiade. Kotinia Kiade. <laughs> uh, translation, please. <laughs> Kukata Kiade. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, it's like a traditional wedding. Uh -huh. To embrace the, the foods. Uh -huh. The, the foods food as well. What are eat? some of the foods that stand out okay, for you? Okay, we have like area? Mokimo. Uh -huh. We have Gideri. Uh -huh. We have... Uh, we have waru, uh -huh. sufu, you know, dufu. Uh -huh. Dufu is very important. <laughs> yeah, we uh -huh. have waru and uh -huh. some other foods. Some other foods. Yeah. A lot of foods. Okay, I, I don't want to focus mainly on the 
people in the Mount Kenya region. But I get your point, mm -hmm. yeah. but it's good to start from home. Yeah. It's charity it's, begins at yeah, home. Because if you understand your culture, it's easier to understand other people's cultures yeah. as well. Yeah. But uh, yes, you told me about the foods, you told me about the traditional weddings. What are some of the other aspects of your culture that you'd like uh, to see coming back and were are really progressive? Okay, I like people to emulate what the guy, the elders did. Uh -huh. You know, uh, like right now, we have some traditional channels going on. Mm -hmm. I'd like even the youth mm -hmm. to be watching those channels. We uh -huh. have teachings from those channels, uh -huh. from the elders of the communities uh -huh. and stuff. Language is very yeah, important. Yeah, language. Uh -huh. People don't know their language. Uh -huh. yeah. which, is, uh, which is really yeah, sad. It's, it's not good. It's uh -huh. not good. Yeah. It's very important that we carry on the language. Because uh, it's very unique for us. Yeah. So we stand out in the world. Your language stands out in the world, and it's so unique for you. So language is one of them. Mm -hmm. Our ways of uh, coming together through marriage, uh, our foods as well, Food? which are very healthy, if you ask me. True. Uh, dreadlocks <laughs> and taverns as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. All right. So <laughs> let's talk about your acting side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you so, uh, a stage play kind of person or a film kind of person? Okay, I'm a film kind of person. Uh -huh. I like being... In front of the camera. In front of the camera. Yeah. All right. We, uh, what are some of the films you've been on so far? Okay. So I've been I've been on KBC doing Kendai Mani. Uh -huh. I I act at Kendai Mani. Uh -huh. And we also. What act role do you play there? Okay. Uh -huh. uh, there are different kind of roles. Uh -huh. Okay. There's one. I was an agent uh -huh. <laughs> to lead their rent. Agent for uh, <laughs> real estate. Uh, Agent for real estate. Uh, All right. We know you guys. We know you guys. So, uh -huh. <laughs> So, agent. Uh -huh. And mostly, I do small, small scenes. Uh -huh. Yeah. So, I'm, right. I'm like upcoming. I'm not like uh, a main You're not character. there uh, yet. Yeah, yeah. But you're building your career in acting. Yeah. All right. Uh, as an actor, uh, do you feel like uh, 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 culture in a, in a pushiwaki mayhem? <laughs> You know the through the films that we are we are doing as a country. Okay, what I can say is mm -hmm. that uh, we have different actor, we have different directors mm -hmm. who are putting on the correct uh, correct ideas and pro different producers who are putting mm -hmm. on great things out mm -hmm. there. So I can say that culture is in the mm -hmm. film industry. Mm -hmm. We we only need to watch, mm -hmm. watch play Kenyan stuff. Watch yes. play Kenyan yeah, stuff. Watch See Kenyan music. Kenyan, Kenyan, Kenyan stuff. music. Kenyan, 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 Kenyan stuff in general. Kenyan stuff. Uh -huh. Our actors. Watch them. Uh -huh. Have you ever watched Selena? Selena, yes. Yeah, it's uh -huh. so nice. I've watched Selena. It's amazing. Yeah. I've watched uh, Stringed. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. Yeah. Kenda Imani. I've yeah, Kenda Imani is amazing. <laughs> yes, it's amazing. <laughs> yeah, it's and so Kenyan content is, is amazing, it's if amazing. you ask me. If we support our own content, mm -hmm. Other people will support it. Yes, but we have one of the it. most prolific actors yeah. in the continent right now. Amen. If you ask. Yeah, Lupita. Uh, yes. <laughs> and uh, also have Eddie Gatege. We have Eddie Gatege as mm. well. Yeah. Doing amazing stuff. Yes. We have amazing musicians taking the Kenyan music international. Yeah, true. And uh, we have guys like you uh, taking the fashion industry as well. Yeah, we uh, international too, so pushing the Kenyan message. All right, so uh, brand, mm -hmm. the Kenyan brand. Do you think we need to focus it on something in particular or we can diversify it? Because I remember there's a time we were looking for the national outfit, if you can oh, remember, yeah, we yeah, were yeah. quite young, <laughs> and it really flopped yeah, like nonsense. True. So, okay, the, I guess the government is doing something like at Wanataka Kushano from Tumba, of which uh, to me, okay, it's, it's, not, it's not good, mm -hmm. but Pia, it's a, it's a good decision uh -huh. to start buying our own stuff. Uh -huh. Like these t-shirts are made locally. Uh -huh. so you from the fabrics? Yeah, from the fabrics. This is Kenyan cotton This right is here. Kenyan cotton, 100%. Uh -huh. 100% cotton. Yeah. Uh -huh. So this is Kenyan, 100% uh, Kenyan cotton made in Kenya, I can see. True. And then the art is also Kenyan. The art is also Kenyan. Wow. So what's your message right here? Okay, my message mm -hmm. to to the people uh -huh. is that you you do something mm -hmm. that can motivate mm -hmm. and can help another person mm -hmm. in this country, and mm -hmm. you can also learn things from other people. Mm -hmm. That is my main message. Mm -hmm. I want to quote someone called Anan, uh, Anais Nin, who said mm -hmm. that we see things as they are, mm -hmm. And we don't see we, we don't see them as we are ourselves. Mm -hmm. So we see things as they are, but mm -hmm. we don't see them as we are. As we are, as yeah. as as part of these things. Yeah, we, don't we don't see them as part of these yeah. things. We see things uh, as they from are. Outside. They're just like that. 
But we, we don't, don't put ourselves yeah, inside we don't put ourselves the picture. Yeah. yeah. Which is very important. Very, very important. Wise words from James right here, or Mr. Jim Jim himself. White Five Four channel on Twitter, White Five Four underscore channel on Instagram, and White Five Four on Facebook. This guy is all about pushing the culture forward and anti radicalization. He has a soft spot for the rasters because he had the dreads. <laughs> all right, so uh, how can we get uh, to a uh, hold of your merchandise? Okay, um, I'm on Instagram. Uh -huh. at just look them straight into the eyes so you can share that with okay. them. Okay, so I'm on Instagram at culture underscore key underscore mayhem. Mm -hmm. You can DM me anytime. You can mm -hmm. give me some designs. You can motivate me. Mm -hmm. You can also put something on on the ideas. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right, so we have your Instagram on screen right here. Oh, nice. Uh, just after you mentioned it, thank you very much, Mr. Director. Culture key mayhem. Embrace culture. the culture. Let's stop radicalization of, of our, our culture. culture. True. Wow. Hmm. So yes, so just go slowly, down slowly. I see something here. This is a lady with uh, with natural hair there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, those are dreads. Those are dreads. Yeah. Uh -huh. and something you're preaching. Yeah, and to the core. I can also say thanks to the people who have bought my T-shirt. Uh -huh. Mostly my friends, uh -huh. so my far. family, uh -huh. and my neighbors. Your family, I'm grateful, I'm grateful. And neighbors, I see you rocking one of them as well. <laughs> right there. I was called Mr. CEO over there. Uh, Mr. CEO. <laughs> so those right. are some of my friends over those there. Those are some of your well friends. There. Yeah. I like the picture uh, in the center. This looks like a professional Actor. shoot kind of setting. Yeah. All she, right. Yeah. This is an actor friend. Yeah. Oh, it's maybe today I'm to me a shout out. I'm a kid yeah. shoot sana. I'm trying to <laughs> Jesse kwa kenda imani. <laughs> Jesse kwa kenda imani. Yeah. All right. Nice shot. <laughs> This uh, crazy mayhem culture key mayhem. This yeah. is the logo for the yeah. This is the logo for the brand. Yeah. All right. Culture key like mayhem. Like this, you have you've been moving, yeah. Yeah, I've been. You've been moving. I see a it's lot. Good. I see a lot of content. Ni mungu. Ni mungu ni mengi. Mande ni mungu ni mungu. All right. Mm. Nice one. Nice one. Nice one. Nice one. Moving forward now. Mm -hmm. Where would you like to see your brand? I'd like to see it in in Kenya as uh -huh. a whole. Uh -huh. And I'd like to see it through Africa. Uh -huh. Yeah, through Africa. Yeah, you'd like to spread it across Africa. To across right. Africa. Uh, apart from T-shirts, so do you like to see it on other brand, on other types of uh, fabric as well? Yeah, as well. Mm -hmm. um, um, uh, there's an undergoing uh -huh. something I'm doing. Mm -hmm. So we, are, we want to put this brand on jumpers. Mm -hmm. we want to put them on polos, uh -huh. on caps. Uh -huh. So many stuffs. So many stuffs. So many. So that equal kwa yumba kila mtu kama made in China. Maze kamu vai tisho unava polo. Kamu vai polo unava jamba. Kamu vai polo unava jamba. Yes, I think we are coming to the end of this. Keep your feedback coming our way. White Five Four channel on Twitter. White Five Four underscore channel on Instagram. White Five Four on Facebook. Don't forget the hashtag Why in the morning. And don't forget the hashtag Entrepreneurship Tuesday. So we have Mr. Jim here or Mr. James or aka Mr. Jim Jim yeah. uh, with the culture key mayhem brand and is all about pushing the culture forward and stopping radicalization of our culture through the fashion. Mr. Uh, your last words to the viewers and how they can get a hold of your merchandise and uh, yes anything you've always wanted to say on TV. Okay thank this you. is your chance. <laughs> I love this chance. Uh, okay so uh, I'm selling my t-shirts uh, through um, online you can find me at Instagram at culture underscore key underscore mm -hmm. mayhem. Mm -hmm. You can also find me at at underscore gym underscore gym. Mm -hmm. DM me anytime and text me. Uh, you can DM me anytime. Mm -hmm. Ask for a t-shirt. We have different colors, different uh -huh. sizes. And I want to leave you with a quote from Wangare Matai who mm -hmm. said that in every uh, difficult, there's, there's an opportunity in every difficult moment. Mm -hmm. So ata hizi corruption tunapitia hapa sahi kama wana Kenya, there's an opportunity. There's an opportunity in every difficult moment. Wise words from this America. That we are coming to the end of this, but the show is not over yet. Entrepreneurship Tuesday is still live on Y in the morning. Thank you very much, Mr. Jim Jim. Thank you. For coming through. And Thanks. thank you very much for pushing the culture. Thank you. I go by the name well. of Bimosis or It's by Mon every social media platform. Keep it locked. Stay tuned and interact with us, chat with us. Hashtag Y in the morning. Hashtag Entrepreneurship Tuesday.